currently 70 degrees, which is the high. Nice overcast, low chance of rain. I'm going to go out here. I'm not going to the beach. I'm going to go that way. Set up a camp. Never know what you're going to run into out here. That leads to the beach, and I'm going to bet that it is a tick trail. I'm going to stay on this old abandoned path. And <clears throat> I may not go all the way in. I originally wanted to camp out overnight. I forgot I had prior commitment Friday evening. So I'm just going to come out here and a little time in and maybe come back in in the morning it should be in the low 60s in the morning well, it's a good thing dad's not here he would be terrified of snakes <laughs> more worried about the ticks they have been thick this year I've already had one get in on my side, and he was dug in. Uh, my clearing's right up there. That's way back. So, made it to my destination. And this is definitely where deer have been sleeping so I actually have to worry about ticks or here I checked my legs I did get some good off deep whatever it's called got my legs coated pretty good so I checked myself when I came through that mess appear to be fine so find some place to Go set up the hammock. Uh, so, I'm not really having any luck without getting into there where it's really deep. Waiting on these cool temperatures for a while now. And it's just not quite cool enough yet. I saw how my check rucksack and I had to bring my condor primitive bush knife which has served its purpose quite well so far I got all this tall brush that was underneath me cleared out oh inside I have my canteen East German tarp uh, some tools and the hammock all right, so got the hard part done. I just have a uh, quick release on both ends, and then tension knots. Just using some Walmart paracord. And actually, Walmart gets knocked on a lot. I got these, of course. Shout out to SRO. I use these. I think these are 80 cents, 50 cents, 40 cents. It's under a dollar. These are good steel tent pegs. Walmart. I'm going to get this stretched out, get the hammock up, and get some relaxing in. And I'm done.
Time to sit back and relax now. Don't think it's going to rain, but I'm covered just in case. Uh, this East German tarp, it was brand new when it was shipped to me. Uh, it's been sitting in a warehouse since the fall of the Berlin Wall, so it's really neat to be out here actually camping and hiking with history. Got this off uh, virustalika.com, Finnish company. And uh, it's nice to have. I'm grateful that I have it. I actually have two of them. Uh, downside is, is the weight. So it doesn't look like I have much out here, but that was quite a heavy pack. So uh, long term, need to find an easier way to transport it for. Go to Harbor Freight and get a Harbor Freight tarp. Actually, not a little bad spot out here. I don't know if it'd be safe to. Asleep there or not.